and welcome to this Science Saves video. My name is Sean and I'm studying physics at the University of Birmingham. Science Saves exists to raise the profile of healthcare science and its associated careers, and these interviews will help provide information to those who are considering a career in healthcare science. In this video, the question that we'll be asking a number of healthcare science staff is, why is healthcare science important in the NHS? Healthcare science is important within the NHS as we are specialists in our field which can better patient care. Healthcare scientists are involved in 80% of all the clinical decisions within the NHS. There are 50,000 people working in healthcare science in 50 different roles. Healthcare scientists are specialist staff who possess the scientific and clinical skills and knowledge that can aid in almost every stage of a patient pathway. We are also trained to take a lead in innovation and improving NHS services to ultimately increase the quality of patient care and improve outcomes. So why is healthcare science important in the NHS? That's kind of, so it's a difficult question, um, mainly because it's essential. Uh, healthcare sciences, well, without the healthcare sciences and the healthcare scientists, um, the NHS would very much struggle to function, I think. Um, healthcare scientists are essential for um, patient pathways, whether that's diagnostics or treating or um, creating the equipment that we need to perform any diagnostic tests on patients. And the stat that's often said is that healthcare scientists make 2% of the workforce but are involved in 80% of uh, diagnoses. And that's that's true. We are the guy, we are the people doing the tests. Um, without healthcare scientists doing the fantastic work that they do, um, the tests might not get done and patient pathways would be compromised. So really, um, healthcare science is absolutely essential in the NHS. And that's why it's such a brilliant career. Healthcare scientists are a very important group of staff in the healthcare system as they provide 80% of diagnosis, prevention, treatment and rehabilitation in the NHS. Healthcare scientists also play a key role in improving patient outcomes as they are accelerating innovation in the healthcare through the research and academic work that they do. We come from a number of uh, strongly scientific backgrounds which I think makes us good problem solvers and we often liaise with a number of different teams within the hospital uh, which can make us well-rounded members of staff and this can give us insight on how to streamline services because the, the, the NHS is a really big uh, a really big organisation and having us that gets to see uh, having us healthcare scientists that get to see things in different departments uh, I think this can give us really good insight on how to work better as the one big team that we ultimately are. Healthcare scientists are more often than not described as people who work behind the scenes, but in reality they play a huge role in saving patients' lives and are actually involved in 80% of the clinical decisions made within the NHS, helping with the prevention, diagnosis and treatment of diseases. And I think that the importance of a healthcare scientist can be seen wherever you look in the hospital, whether it be in maintaining medical equipment like MRI machines, researching new medical technologies, laboratory-based diagnostics, or measuring organ function at the patient bedside. And really, let's not forget the pandemic. Healthcare scientists have played an absolutely massive role in generating results from all the COVID tests and, of course, developing vaccinations for the entire world. So you've probably heard the statistic that healthcare scientists are behind 80% of all clinical decisions in the NHS. Um, we carry out a lot of the diagnostic testing and monitoring and our results help to make a clearer picture of the patient's condition and help to inform their management and care. So it's important for our measurements and results to be accurate because it could affect patient treatment. Um, healthcare scientists are also involved in a lot of research and innovation um, because science is such an active field and there's always ways to make things more efficient, more consistent and more patient friendly. So when, when anybody asks me, uh, where do you work? Oh, I used to work in the hospital. Oh, are you a nurse? And I always used to say, no, I worked in medical physics, and that was just too complicated for a lot of people to, to grasp. And so I just used to say, oh, I'm a radiographer, because that seemed to be the nearest thing that people understood from a point of view of physics in the health service. But there's, um, there's over 50 different types of scientists that work in the NHS. Um, and actually, healthcare scientists underpin over 80% of all diagnoses that go on in a hospital. 
So there's 50 types of scientists, they're dotted around the hospital, some in microbiology, cardiac, resp respiratory medicine, um, blood sciences, neurosciences, or geology. Um, and one that's been very much in the news lately, immunology and virology. But there's also people that work in um, clinical bioinformatics. So uh, they're helping to use artificial intelligence now to advance diagnosis and medicine. I'd like to thank the healthcare staff who participated in this video. And what we can take away from this is that healthcare science is a vital part of the NHS. If you like this video, then remember to like and subscribe to the Science Saves YouTube channel. You can also follow us on Twitter and Facebook at SciSaves, S-C-I-S-A-V-E-S. Thanks for watching.